Uh, Pat came on board, I think, basically August 1st or beginning part of August, about three years ago. And within, uh, we were heading to Hawaii. So the first time I met him, uh, he said, I want you and your partner to come on the plane to Hawaii football game. You know, I, at that particular time, I had two children. Uh, one was three and the other one was just a little over one. And uh, I hadn't even been acknowledged of having two children. Mm -hmm. So the fact that he just said that to me made me know that everything was going to be okay. As an administrator, you know, we've made incredible strides in the last three years because, you know, with, with Pat taking over, um, we acknowledge actually the existence of gay and lesbian student athletes are actually here on our campus and alive and well. And before that, we didn't have that. We would try different ways, and I know I have a colleague in the audience that was here during that time of different ways to maneuver the back doorway to get up, and I just felt it was absolutely ridiculous. Here we are in the, you know, 2000, I've been here for 10 years, 2006, and I, I can't get, you know, any movement on the gay and lesbian issues. So ever since Pat took over, it's much more open. We're still making strides here as administration. And, uh, you know, it's everyone pretty, you know, there I have a lot of, a couple of swimmers in the back there that, I mean, they know that I'm gay. I make no, I make no, uh, I don't cover that up at all right now because I don't feel I need to. You know, when I was an administrator before, when, when we, the previous administration was here, I took my cues from the, SWA that was in charge and that was Lisa Love and Lisa Love did not say anything about anything uh, she went to Arizona State and was out at Arizona State and I guess that was great for Arizona State but while we were here um, you know we knew we had an ally but she wasn't really waving the flag or anything so that's kind of where I took my cues from as far as my role model but now my my role model is, uh, is Pat Hayden, who is just all about support and all about student athlete welfare. And it's great to be able to have a, uh, a gay and lesbian task force and being able to produce a film, you know. Sorry, at the coaches retreat, uh, we showed some of the other Pac-12, you can play videos. And after it was all done, and I hadn't, I don't think I had yet talked to Donna or Pat with the idea of creating a USC one. I was sitting down at the um, table, like gathering all my materials afterwards, and Pat Hayden comes up to me and he's like, we're doing a video. It's gonna be better than all those. <laughs> 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 and I'm like, okay. 